Please download Telugu Stop Android app in Play Store or iOS app in App Store and stay tuned to latest news as it happens. New Delhi, October 26th. With over a month left for crucial Telangana Assembly elections, the Congress on Thursday demanded that all the cash benefits be immediately transferred to farmers, Dalits, housing beneficiaries, Muslims, and other beneficiaries before the date of notification, November 3rd, in the southern state. Addressing a press conference at the party headquarters here, senior Congress leader Uttam Kumar Reddy said, On behalf of Congress in Telangana, we are demanding that all cash benefits be immediately transferred to farmers, Dalits, housing beneficiaries, Muslims, and other beneficiaries before the date of notification. He also said that the use of official places, such as the chief minister's residence and MLA camp offices, built at the cost of the public, should not be used for the BRS political activities. The Congress leader also said that even the officials favoring the ruling Bharat Rashtra Samiti, BRS, should not be assigned key critical election duties. Reddy said, We have seen how partisan has been there in the state for the last nine years and they are working on party agenda for many years. We have given names of the officials to the election commission, he added. Meanwhile, Telangana Congress Chief A. Ravent Reddy said, In Telangana, the BJP and the BRS are misusing the government institutions to defeat the Congress. Many officers are posted at a place for many years and they are working to collect election funds for BRS. He also alleged that by giving regular posting to the retired officers, they are being made .to work like a private army has been made to target the opposition parties. The Congress leader also said that many media outlets are running wrong stories against the party and we have complained about it with the election commission. Meanwhile, Uttam Kumar Reddy also said that the sinking of the Medigadda barrage in Telangana's is something of national disaster. He said that a lakh of crore rupees has been spent on the project. These dams are supposed to last for 100 years and to withstand earthquake to the magnitude of 8 to 9 on Richter scale but they are giving silly excuses for corruption, negligence. We have been saying this for last nine and a half years that the K. Chandrasekhar government is one of the most corrupt governments in the country. And it is proven today by the poor quality of the Medigadda barrage and it is astonishing that the central government is not finding it appropriate to move faster than what they are doing. He added, the voting for 119-member assembly election in Telangana is scheduled on November 30th and counting of votes will be taken up on December 3rd. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to channel and click on bell for more daily videos.